The City of Plano and Plano ISD have come together to help children in need. The mentor program at Carlisle was started about, I've been in the program 15 years, and prior to that I think it had one other year with another teacher. So I've been doing it that long. And as I've done it, I've kind of added different things through the years, and so it's really grown. It's quite large now. Um, I started out by uh, trying to find materials, and I realized that the best thing that worked for our school was games, academic board games. So I kind of steered away from the materials and kind of focused on that. Children from all walks of life benefit from this program. Students in grades K through five, they come to us with different kinds of baggage. For example, uh, they come from single parent homes. Sometimes they live with their grandparents. Sometimes they live with an aunt and uncle. Uh, sometimes they come to us and they're from another country. And they come over here and they don't even know English. And so they've got to learn English, learn our customs, learn how school works in the United States because it's different from their school system. Uh, another reason that they would be in the mentor program is sometimes they're just not strong students. They struggle in reading or they struggle in math. And, you know, we do a lot of things during the day to help them to improve that, but it's interesting how a mentor can come in, a grown-up, and just do a little board game, reinforce these weak skills that they have, and by the end of the year, they're very strong. They're even higher than, say, some of the regular kids who don't have a mentor. So these are the types of students that we have in the mentor program. Uh, they are recommended by their teacher. Sometimes we'll have a student that's kind of shy, uh, most kids aren't, but you get a few that are shy. They don't want to talk in class. They're even shy around their teacher. And so that would be another reason why we might get a mentor for them. And of course, in the beginning, it's kind of hard for that mentor because they may not be talking very much. But by the end of the year, they're chatty Cathy's. You know, you can't even get them to stop talking long enough to insert your sentence. And the rewards are breathtaking. The most rewarding part of the program is when, and I know most of these fa kids fairly well, when I see them struggling in school, shy, lacking self-confidence, after, and it's not really the end of the year that I'm looking towards, in just a matter of months I see a change in them. They're happier children, they exude confidence, they're not afraid to speak to you, and then when you talk to their teacher, you find out that their grades have gone up. And it really, that it's, it's nothing different, they're, they're acting kind of like mom and dads when they're here when they're mentoring because you're kind of just sharing from your experiences and just being a good listening ear for one hour and, and just talking with that child, it, it's, it's wonderful to them. It's like a treasure because even though they're here at school and we spend time with them, it's not, we don't spend a solid hour giving them undivided attention and that's what they get in the mentor program. They get our undivided attention but it's short because we have 22 to 25 kids in a class and you want to be fair to everybody so when they get a mentor it's like their grown-up friend that they get for this whole hour to themselves that's going to listen to everything that they say and offer suggestions and play a game with them what could be better than that for more information contact Tammy Stewart at 469-752-0673 or Robin Popick at 972-941-7617